Right, hi, I just wanted to work on this with you a little bit more because I'm ready, I think, nearly ready to get it put in my ledger. So what I thought I would do is introduce a bit of colour and how I'm going to do that is I'm going to put some French knots in and the French knots are going to go all the way under here and the same at the other side of this bit, um, under here, just that little tiny bit there. But I'm not going to do them all the way along today because that would be a very long video. And I don't like looking for the cotton abroad. And I don't like putting very, very long videos on my blog. People doing my classes will be rolling around the floor in hysterics now because they get hours and hours. They grow beards. It's a well-known fact. So, what I'm going to do is just do a few white ones and then just add a little bit of colour, like I say, I won't keep you for long. So, well I'm told on good authority that the proper correct way to do French knots is to just do two wraps. I want to do three, so, and I don't think the French knot police will come round and arrest me if I do three. doing them, not doing them in a straight line, you might have noticed that, I'm sure you've noticed that. I'm trying to build up a, a little cushion of them in order to add some coloured ones. For some reason it doesn't want to pull through. And there's a little bit of that red hanging down the back there, I can see it through the thing and it's annoying me, so I'm going to cut it off. probably get a picture of this as well that isn't damp stretched so I can only apologise for that so if I do one more white one so they're going to be kind of quite organic so they're going to be like that all the way along here in fact I'll just keep doing white till my thread runs out and then I don't waste any thread But simplicity is the key here because if you think about what's on here, that was a full handkerchief and that was all there was on the corner, so it was minimal. So I'm trying to keep it simple, although it could be argued that there's more embellishment on here than perhaps needed to be because of all the bullion loops up here, perhaps. But I'll let you make your own mind up about that. So finish off now with the light there. Whoops. Keep a tidy table Karen. Put your debris away. Right so now I've already got some pink in my needle so I'll put a knot in this. And I'll do a couple of pink and I want to do a couple of green because I'm trying to keep the colours simple in terms of living with the already existing embroidery. Kind of trying to mirror that in a sense, even though you could argue that this is detracting from that. But that's contrast, that's as much of a, as a contrast of a contrast that I want to keep in here. So just in amongst all these white ones do a few pink ones and like I say I'll do this all along so 
So if I do three, and then I'll put some green ones in as well. It's not big enough for anything. And why would I have one that back on there, I wonder? This is a... Uh, don't know what's happened with this, I can't find my end. Well, there it is. So that needs to be rewound, doesn't it? Thread your needle, Karen. What's wrong with you? Oh, What's that? oh no! What was the knot in there? I already haven't started stitching it. What's going on? It's a conspiracy. This must happen to everybody. Tell me, catch it out. Life's too short to faff around with knots. Oh, now I can't thread my needle, I'm having a disaster. What's going on? I bet you're thinking, come here for embroidery. She's the most incompetent person. Gets knots and everything, can't thread a needle. It's called normality, because I know, I just know that it happens to you. Now, one of these pink ones has hidden itself under the red edge of this hanky, but that doesn't matter because it, it kind of, it's nice that there's still something going on under there that it doesn't stop dead at the edge of the hanky. So I'll do one more green and that'll be it. But hopefully you'll be able to see. I'll pull in when I've done it. Hopefully you'll be able to see how that I get a, a sense of how that might look all the way along there. So if I fasten that off now. Put that there. And I'll pull in so you can see that. There. It's a nice, like a little garden. The French knots, quite textured. Okay. 